Hey friends, it is Isaac Hayes bringing you a brand new best competitive spots video on Stronghold. This is going to be search and destroy. These are just going to be some little nerd spots that I'm going to show you guys. So let's get into it. Alright, this first spot is going to be for defense. What you want to do is just come down here and head glitch bomb. And you can actually see the wall run right there. And then to the left you can see the bottom house door. It's really a good spot to hold down bottom house. Yeah. Alright, for this spot, what you want to do is rush top house on defense as quick as possible. Maybe with an overdrive or something, make good use of it. And you want to come down to this flower pot and just sit on it, crouch, and you can see that head glitch right there. It's really good. Alright, for this next spot, what you want to do is come to this wall run. Wall run at the very top, and once you get to this end, just jump up right here next to this tree. You can see a lot of things, and I'm actually probably one of the first ones to find this because i found this like the second day the game actually came out i just never had a youtube channel to show it for this spot you're gonna want to come up here next to b bomb and jump up on this and you can actually single jump and see that head glitch if you're having a good sniper day or something i don't know what you're doing but if you have a good shot and get a single jump kill out of that nice yo this is a hidden dude I didn't even know this spot existed. I was just messing around. I just found a new spot. Bonus. Yo, you can lay down and see the doorway. I'm done. This next spot is actually a little corner that I saw somebody go in. I'm not sure if it's the best corner, but it's definitely situational. And you might just want to keep this in mind as you go around the map. Maybe if you're in a 1v1 situation, people usually run past and jump up. But you can go right here in this corner and it might just win you the round. Alright, this is a good defensive spot, especially if somebody is watching mid. You can lay down right here, and you can see a little bit right there, but my favorite spot for doing this is laying down right here. You can actually see a lot, and they usually won't see you, especially if you have that white psychosis suit that some people use. You're hidden. You're just hidden. That's all there is to it. Nobody can see you. Just pop up, bang, bang. They don't even know what just happened. This is a good defensive spot. If you're like 5'5", five, five and you just want to play really passive, you can sit right here and watch the whole back house and somebody can sit on this right like right here and watch B bomb push and the bunker push. It's really a good setup for like a 2v2 match or something. So yeah, just use the statue to your advantage. Alright, this is another defensive little strat. You can lay down under this dinner table right here. And you can go on both sides, it's whichever side you really want to be on. But you will definitely get first shot and they will almost, I doubt they will see you. Unless they are literal hawks. If you're playing against birds, they might do a little something weird. But you can also see the wall run if you position yourself right. Alright, this is going to be the last spot that I show you guys. What you want to do is jump up on this rock and have a sniper. And you can jump up right here and see B-Bomb and snipe them. I have more spots that I'm not going to show you. So come check out my stream and you might pick some up on my stream. But anyway, like, comment, subscribe. You know, my normal outro. And I will see you guys later. Goodbye. Oh my god.